Welcome to our first ever property hints, tips and advice video. We're going to let you in on our secrets on how to dress your property. So we're going to share with you some of the secrets of our photography and videography. We're also going to give you top tips so that you can dress your property in a way that you're going to get a quicker sale and more money. And we're going to start today with the living room. So we've got two photos from a mobile phone, one with a standard and one with a wide angled lens. And these have been deliberately cluttered to show you what poor photography looks like, but it also highlights poor lighting. Uh, the window at the front of the room is the only light source that you've got there, which makes that part of the room really light and the rest of it really, really dark. So let's see what we did to improve this room. And we're gonna give you our top tips for how to dress your living room. So clear away any cups and clutter that you've got on your surfaces. Turn off the TV and hide the remotes. Plump the sofa and dress the cushions and remove any pet blankets that you've got on your sofas. Okay, light your uh, multi-fuel stove or fire, add flowers or plants, uh, maybe light candles and ambient lights and move furniture if necessary. And now this is the after photo, which almost looks like a different room. We've completely tidied and we've decluttered, making the room presentable. We've even moved a side table with a plant to fill the blank space under the mirror. But the big difference is the lighting. And this is one of our top secrets. By using a professional quality camera with a tripod and a flash, we can control the light levels within the room to ensure that the photo is both bright, crisp and also inviting. But we still don't think that this entirely is the best way to show off your property. I mean, there's so much more to this room than you can see just in this still photograph. We believe we aren't just selling a property, we're selling a dream and a lifestyle to your potential buyer. So this is the same room, but just presented in a short video clip, which we think really helps to present the room to its best potential and really sell it to the buyers. So now we're going to move to the kitchen diner, yep. So these are our top tips for kitchen and dining space. Move the bin out of the way, remove any dirty cups, pots from the sink and keep the surfaces as clear as possible. Also move pet bowls and litter trays out of sight. If you've got a really nice kitchen with a focus on cooking, then have a cookbook on a stand. Move any laundry baskets out of the way. And then the big one for me is if you've got a dining table or a breakfast table, just get that set. As with the living room, we have these before and after photos. This is a top tip for if you've got a small kitchen with not much worktop space, clear it to give you the illusion of more space. So again, we've got clean, clear, bright and crisp photography. And we've even angled the chairs to ensure that you can see the dress table in the photo. And then as before, we've finished it off with a nice short video clip. So this bathroom we're showing on screen now is a great example of how to present your bathroom. And these are our top tips. Uh, so number one, put the toilet seat down. No one wants to see inside the toilet. Uh, toilet roll on a hanger or get it out of the way. Uh, remove any excess bottles of shampoo or conditioner and ideally put them in containers if you've got them. Again, the same with bleach and any cleaning products. Place clean and fresh towels over the towel rail. And if you are gonna have a bath mat in there as well, make sure it's color coded with the towels. And the shower screen and mirrors are to be as clean and lime scale free as possible. So bedrooms are also ones that can be really tricky, uh, especially if you've got children or if you've got teenagers as well. 
so here are our top tips for the bedrooms. So uh, neatly make the beds with fresh linen and add a cushion or a cute teddy. Put any clothes away in your wardrobes or drawers. We definitely don't want to see them on the floor. Okay, clear under the bed or put stuff in the storage boxes out of sight. Tidy dressing tables or sets of drawers. Tidy away children's toys as much as possible. And if you've got a teenager's room, just do your best. And if it's a teenage boy's room, just make sure you get rid of those nudie pictures from the wall. So if you are thinking of selling, we do hope that these tips have helped you. Don't hesitate to give us a call. We can have a friendly chat and even maybe arrange a free market appraisal for you. So we're going to leave you today with a snippet from a property which we listed and we absolutely love. And this is a perfect way to present your property. And when we say we are selling a dream and not just a house, this is what we mean. So this property was under offer within hours of the first viewing and ended up selling for nearly 5% above asking price. So uh, we'll see you next week. Enjoy this video.